Today we'll be installing an AFX kit on a Yamaha FJ1200. We'll be doing this to rejet the carburetor so we can make max power at wide open throttle, yet conserve fuel at idle and cruising speeds. Determining a location for the sensor is very important, and remember the 10 degree rule. 10 degrees above 9 or 3 o'clock. This will ensure proper runoff of any condensation. With the exhaust in the bike, mark your hole. Next we want to drill the hole and prepare for welding. Cleaning all paint and rust off the pipe is crucial for a good solid weld. After welding you want to run a tap through the bung as welding can cause distortion. Here is what our exhaust looks like after being reinstalled. Remember to route the wires safely. You don't want them damaged by moving parts or heat. We are using zip ties for this installation as it is only temporary. Mounting the AFX box in the rider's view is very important as you need to see the readout while driving. We wired the AFX positive wire into the fuse panels only on when the bike is on. Then we neatly tuck the additional wiring under the seat. Looking at the picture, you will see the O2 sensor hanging below the exhaust. You do not want to install it yet. Let it hang next to the pipe. With the installation complete, we are now ready to calibrate the sensor. In our next video, we will discuss AFX calibration. If you have any questions about installing your AFX system, please call us at 877-473-6767 and hit extension 2 for tech or visit us at ngksparkplugs.com.